my name is Mark and I would like 100,000 subscribers. <laughs> I could type a million, but I don't want to get greedy right now. How's that? Letter to Santa Claus. Today's video adventure brings us to Target and the VCC. <laughs> this is the Christmas shopping extravaganza. And there's a reason for this. We're gonna to get to that shortly. Just don't get the wobbly wheeled one. All right, so the reason for today's adventure, we're giving back to the community. And we're doing the KLUC toy drive. And Michelle has already found gigantic dolls. Every year, a Las Vegas DJ from a radio station here in town goes up on this giant scaffolding or up on this crane. And I forgot, how, how long do they stay up there, Michelle? How long does Chet stay up there? He stays up on this crane for like two weeks and he does the Toys for Tots toy drive. And every year he cleans up. And we just want to be part of it. So we're walking up and down the aisles of Target. Oh, look who it is. It's Hey Hey from uh, Moana. Hey Hey from Moana. One of the funniest characters in the movie. This is like the Disney aisle here. There's princesses and uh, all the things that little girls love. Some little girls. It's Sebastian. Now we're talking giant robots that crush things. I love being a boy. <laughs> all the cool toys. Dragons. Who remembers this when we were kids? And how how far did you get? This damn thing used to annoy the hell out of me. I would play it for a while and then I'd totally get lost and couldn't finish it. And I, I forget what level I'd get to, but it was, I'd throw it across the room. Now we're talking the Star Wars aisle. Uh-oh, the Mandalorian and Legos, Nick. The Mandalorian. This is the way we Lego. And we have Captain Rex. That's too cool. Nick's all about good guys with his Mandalorian. I, on the other hand, am a fan of Darth Vader and his asthma. Do you guys remember toys this cool when we were growing up? Seriously. I mean, our toys we thought were cool at the time, but not like this. This is... I remember like electric football, which was just a disaster. Oh yeah, where it just vibrated around yeah, the board. Yeah, like, you know, 20, 30 minutes setting this thing up and... <laughs> <laughs> it was just a disaster. Yeah, it was terrible. And these kids nowadays, but they're expensive though. These are not cheap. Nice. Hey lady, you can't park here. <laughs> she said sorry. I'm joking with her. She said sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna while they're over here, I'm gonna go down and look at bicycles. See how much those are. I have chosen present number one, a razor scooter. It's actually not bad price. Now we're supposed to drop these off unopened. So I'll just drop it off in the box and we'll show you the whole setup that KUC does when we get over there. But uh, $30 for a scooter? I remember these came out, they cost a hell of a lot more than that. So I'm thinking the Razor's for a kid, I don't know, seven years old and up, to, I don't know, 10, 11, 12. So I wanna look at something for smaller kids because I think, and I could be wrong, but I think that when people come and do these toy drives, they buy more for a um, little bit older kids and I wanna get something for the younger ones. Exhibit A, a scooter for a two-year-old. This is Toys for Tots, right? Uh, 
I, I don't know if it's toys for tops, but what they do is they set up a store, like a fake store. So you have all the unwrapped toys, they set it up, and then the parents, I don't know how they're selected, they're given a certain amount to spend, and so then they go in and kind of shop for the toys. So if they say like, you have $200 to spend, and then they say this is 20, then it's like fake money. That's how they do it? I didn't know that. They pick them for their own kids. Okay. Whatever, and I don't know how they determine like, who can participate or how much you get, but the parent actually picks it out in like this fake store. That's awesome. We are paid for. It was $70 for two scooters. We're gonna get these in the back of the car. And uh, we're gonna head on over to wherever the hell it is we have to go. I always hated the jerks in the parking lot that left their shopping carts just hanging out all by the cars wind rolls them down into your hood while you're or into your fenders or your door when you're in shopping because they can't come over here 25 feet and put it away. This was, uh, Nick was over here writing a letter to Santa. Where's your letter? Oh, that's cute. Kids can come and uh, write letters to Santa Claus. So the, the bear gives me a hug if I go up to it? Oh, okay, let's check this out. So here's the bear. Am I gonna get a hug? Oh, look, I got a hug from the bear. <laughs> look at him, He's doing the, Dork. <laughs> a bunch. It makes a GIF, yeah, it makes a GIF image of it. You just change positions. You can't even begin to understand the amount of bicycles that have been donated to this drive. It is freaking so heartwarming to see. It's so awesome. Toys are being delivered now. Michelle's totally networking right now. <laughs> Very cool. They have filled up so far in this toy drive, 12 trucks full of toys have been taken out of here. That's freaking amazing. Hopefully other YouTubers will kick in and come down and bring toys down. I think it'd be cool. Be amazing. Yeah. I love that you guys were running a crew. I did not know that there were YouTube YouTubers that ran in a crew. Oh yeah, That's oh yeah. Awesome. yeah. Exactly. Support it. Support and growth and building community. That's what it's about. Fantastic. Appreciate you, man. You totally well, rock, bro. You. I learned something today. <laughs> what did we get? Oh, it's a KLUC. You see... Oh, ornament, right on. And then we got a sticker that says we donated to the drive. We are down right here, the VCC. That's so cool. Santa, please read my letter. And you know us, 99% of the time, we don't ever film a video without having dinner. And Michelle chose this one, and I'm okay with it because it's they got really, really good food. Mm. 
Mas por favor. Steve-O opens the secret door. It's super busy in here tonight. If you're not here to drink, you could always get the other shit. Five Extreme Tacos. Thai Chili, Habanero, Trinidad Scorpion, Carolina Reaper, Carolina Reaper Extreme. No, thank you. No, 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 thank you. I know he's screaming in the restroom later. This is the second year that I've come here at Christmas time and they decorated it for uh, Nightmare Before Christmas last year, but it fits. It goes with the skulls. It's really, really cool to see it hol holiday decorated in here. And our food is coming out. These are the taquito bites. I told you they have bites here and they're really really good oh you got an olote corn too oh look at that mmm and carnitas taco if memory serves me correctly these were really really good and they got a little cheese dip right here for that so yummy these are the taquito bites yep kind of tastes like those taco snacks you got when you're in elementary school really good this is the steak F-bomb. It's basically Cheetos covered in steak and cheese and pico. And this right here is the carnitas muy caliente. So pork and flaming hot Cheetos is what my taco is. This would be Alex's thing. He freaking loves elote. I'll get some corn in my bite. That's really, really good. Especially when you get a lot of corn in the bite with all that. Oh my God, that's really, really good. Michelle swears by the muy, muy caliente taco. She gets steak. I got carnitas. I'm gonna give it a shot. Is it really hot? Spicy? Who would have thought hot Cheetos would be so good on a taco? That's really, really good. It's really good. It's good. It's super good. Chosen, snow is falling, Elfie's calling, check my list twice, most of y'all done, sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blinging, carol singing, favorite season, sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blinging, carol singing, favorite season. Are you, are you ready? Uh, look, look at Michelle, she's dancing as we're leaving this place. This is like the funnest part of the of Mas Por Favor to film is to walk down this hallway light. It's pretty cool. What, what's funny is when you come out of the speakeasy, if you don't know the speakeasies back there, you're sitting out here like a regular fast food taco place, getting your food and eating at these tables. You, you don't know the bars back there. With the red nose. When I fly high, my sleigh still stay ten toes. Bring the feet, bring the cheese, bring the cheese. Put the lights up. 
tis the season. Me no Grinch types, no Ebenezer. Don't believe this. Y'all need Jesus. Y'all need Jesus. Slay bells ringing. Everybody's doing their review over here. I'm just kind of hanging out. I've eaten here before. Michelle's eaten here. This is Michelle's favorite taco place. That's all there is to it. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. You got up in that bag, yeah. I got a rex rex in my sack or in my bag, yeah. They said the same thing, but you got up in that bag, yeah. I got a rex rex in my sack or in my bag, yeah. It's the same Nick, but you got up in that bag, yeah. I got racks, racks in my sack or in my bag, yeah. They said same Nick, but you got up in that bag. I got racks, racks in my sack or in my bag. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs>